What's up y'all? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Dina and we're here just chilling in the camper today. This is a video that I've actually been meaning to release for at least the past month or more. If you haven't noticed, I haven't released a video in a while compared to the rate that I was releasing them. The last travel vlog that I released was in Florida and I'm actually coming to you from right outside of Denver, Colorado. We made our way across the U.S. all the way to California, up the California coast, and have made our way to Colorado, gradually heading back east, back home to North Carolina. We've still got a lot to see, and it's been the most legendary trip. We've had a great time. I'm just here chilling with Nori and Willie. We're actually watching Moana right now. Adam is actually going to pick up his sister who has flown here from North Carolina to come spend the week with us. So we're very excited. There's been a lot that has happened since my last travel vlog. And the reason why I haven't released a travel vlog is because while we were in Los Angeles, our baby girl Diva, our first little girl, passed away. And I guess that's why I haven't released this video I, I knew that I'd started to tear up. If you followed me on Instagram at dina.joy you might have seen the post where we got her paw print tattoos in LA from our good friend Mr. Rich. Sorry guys. We had her for 15 years and she lived an amazing life and I'm actually thankful for the way we got to say goodbye to her. Since that has happened, I kind of reevaluated uh, the way that I was living, I guess, uh, you know, I was taking a look at my schedule and how I was allotting my time. And I'm no stranger to death. I've had several relatives pass away. So I'm very familiar with the grieving process. And I knew that I wanted to reevaluate and find balance so that I wouldn't fall into any sort of, um, prolonged sadness uh, that could lead into any type of depression or anything because I know those feelings will come but I don't have to let them get down in my spirit so me releasing a video on the schedule that I was it was just taking up too much of my time and energy that I could have been just enjoying the trip or spending time with my dogs and Adam and my cats. So I took time to, you know, meditate a little bit more. By the way, I use the app Balance to meditate. That's what I've used for the past three plus years and it's an excellent app. I'm not affiliated with them at all, but you can get a free year, which is how I started and I ended up getting a lifetime membership with them because I, I love that app so much and it's helped me to live in the moment more. It's helped me to control my breathing more and just understand um, how feelings, they come and go. But anyways, I've decided to not stop making the travel vlogs, but I'm not going to release them as quickly as I was. I'm going to focus more on just shooting footage while we're out here on the road and I know that when I'm ready I'll start editing and making those videos again. Not only do I star in the videos but I edit them, put the music to them, I film them and shoot them. So it's a one woman show and I love doing it but it's just not a, a time for me to go so hard with it. 
it's something that I want to do at my leisure for my pleasure and to be able to share with you guys. And I have standards for my videos, so I don't want to push them out without meeting those standards as well. There's a lot I'm so excited to share with you though. We went to the Grand Canyon, Houston, Texas, San Antonio, which was a beautiful city. We've been to some amazing concerts and done some amazing hikes and there's still so much more to come. But like I said, I'm gonna focus on shooting these videos and making sure I get the content that I want to while we're out on the road. And I'll always have that footage to be able to edit whether we're back at home by that time or if I just find myself in the mood to create a wonderful video. And my video, my travel vlogs, you know, they, they run, tend to run between 10 to 20 minutes. And that is a lot of editing. And I just want to reiterate that it, it's time that I want to spend living in the moment, in the present. I actually watched the movie Soul for the first time last week. And if you haven't seen it, I highly recommend it. The moral of that story is very similar to what I realized after Diva passed away. Um, and I just want to keep that mindset moving forward. So this video right here is going to be very lightly edited. I just wanted to come to you heart to heart and let you know why I've made changes to the channel. And also, if you've been with me since the beginning, you know that I started my channel doing gardening videos, uh, harvesting recipe videos, how to grows. And that is my true passion. And I decided to do the travel vlogs uh, just to continue my love for uh, creating content. And I still will. I'm still going to create shorts and reels. Uh, so please follow me on Instagram if you want to keep up to date with our travel journey. Um, it's much easier to release a, you know, 30 second to a minute and a half video than it is to release a 30 minute one or 20 minute one. So I will still be creating content and when we get back home, I'm looking forward to creating a garden once again and releasing more garden content. Like I said, that's my true passion is growing my own food and cooking with it and nourishing my body and my families with that nutrient dense food from the ground. It's what I love and it's also what Adam loves. So I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to the rest of this trip. We're going to be traveling till at least next spring. And I'm just excited for what's to come. And thank you for sticking with me if you're watching this. Uh, like I said, it was kind of a difficult video <laughs> for me to put out. I just was, you know, afraid that... I couldn't get my words out, but today I felt like I could. So now that it's out, I'm looking forward to this next week with my sister that's flying in and we're going to have some great times. So once again, follow me on Instagram. If you want to stay up to date with our travel journey at Dina.joy, we're actually at a wonderful hip camp right now and I'll be sharing a lot about our time here in Colorado and what's to come. So thank you for tuning in. Thank you for listening and understanding. And I hope that when things happen, when challenges happen in life, I hope that you take the time to reflect and reevaluate how you're spending your time and your energy so that you don't fall into any kind of negative cycle. With that said, 
I wish you all the best. Sending you all my love from Colorado. And until next time, guys, keep growing.